Welcome lads, we're back for another review. Today we are looking at 83 rated Jekko. He has got 68 pace, 82 shooting, 72 passing, 75 dribbling and 76 physical. With 2 star skill moves, 4 star weak foot, medium medium work rate, he's 6 foot 3, He's an okay player. He's not a player I like. He doesn't fit my playstyle. The guy cannot control the ball. His positioning is pretty awful. Yes, he can head the ball, but I felt so many times he just wasn't in the box. If he gets a chance, he's going to shoot and he's going to score. But the problem is his dribbling is so bad that you're not really going to have the space a lot of the times to shoot with this guy. Anyways, now let's move on to some in-game stats. Looking at his skill stats, he doesn't have the best ball control 81, and I felt that it was so much lower than that. 77 dribbling, 84 finishing, 90 heading accuracy, 89 shot power, and 77 short passing. Now, when we look at this guy's physical stats, he has okay attack and positioning at 87, with 70 acceleration, 60 agility, 84 strength, and 66 sprint speed. But I feel a lot of these stats are lying. Because his positioning was not nearly that good. His touch, for me at least, was atrocious. Any sort of power pass into him, it just bounced off him and went the exact opposite direction. Yes, if he gets a chance, he's going to score. He's a really good finisher. As you can see in a lot of these highlights coming up, he scores some pretty nice goals. But apart from that, the stats are good. There's nothing wrong with the stats. I just, for me, he just could not play well. But now, let's move on to some highlights. Jekko is a very strong player. And when we talk about what's good about him, he is a good finisher. And he's a strong guy. But the fact is, he has horrible dribbling. His ball control is at times atrocious. And... The two-star skill moves really become troubling. You know, you want to make that quick move to create that chance, get that little bit of space, and he just can't do it. You're just kind of handicapped too much, in my opinion. I don't think he's worth it. Yes, he's a bit above discard value, so he's not going to cost you anything as he pulls that out of the bag. He does something like that, and I'm like, okay, maybe I was wrong about him. But I played eight games with him, and he scored me seven goals. I mean, the returns were great, but it was more like that he would do some horrible things and then he would get a chance like this and put the ball away and I'd be like, okay, is this player bad or is he just getting lucky? I mean, and the fact is, I felt that if I was going to get good results with my team playing, he couldn't do anything except get into position to score. I didn't want to pass it to him because his positioning was generally awful and when he did pass it, it was okay, but his ball control, so bad. But the guy scores goals. He knows how to do that. Anyways, that's the end of this video. Make sure to drop a like, drop a comment, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye-bye.